I think some of you are interested in knowing what would life be like in another country. A typical day in France would start by taking the school bus. Indeed, we have to wait to be 18 to be able to drive. Every day, the schedule changes. One day we would start at 8 and get out of school at, at 5, whereas the next day we would start at 10 and finish at 6. The freshmen have fewer hours than the seniors. Here is an example of, this, of a junior schedule. All these classes are required until the end of high school. Here, you take a class until you fulfill your credit, but in France, you need to take those classes until you graduate. Most of the schools get out at noon on Wednesdays. Sometimes we might have a free period between two periods, which is pretty annoying, I have to say. Our lunch is usually two hours long. Everyone can go off campus, but most of the time we stay on the campus because it's cold outside and the food is, at school is cheaper, good and pretty healthy. For about four dollars, we have an appetizer like tomatoes, lettuce, or different kinds of salads. Then we have an entry where we can choose between two different meats or veggies. And for the dessert, we can get something with milk like a yogurt or some cheese, a fruit or something sweet. Lunch is the best part of the school day for most of the students. We have a room where we can watch TV, listen to the music, or even play cards. Some students prefer use this time to do their homework alone or with other people who can help each other. Oh, something also different from America. We can smoke in front of the school. A few years ago, students could smoke on campus, but now they just have to be behind the gate. Sometimes even the staff smoke with them. Some information about our school system. High school is only three years long in France. We start as a sophomore, and we have four years in middle school. At the end of a sophomore year, we have to take a choice between different kinds of classes. It's still general classes like French, history, math, but you have a kind of you have kind of a specialization. You can specialize in literature, sciences, or economics and social studies. Those are the main specializations. The choice that you make will change the value of your diploma. So when you apply for a school, they will look what kind of graduation you got. So for example, if you apply for an engineering school and you have a literature diploma, they won't take you first. That's why it's important to make the good choice at this point in the high school. For the students who aren't sure about their future, they usually choose the science track because it's easier to get into college. The school year is divided into three trimesters instead of two semesters. At the end of high school, all the seniors in France take the same test, depending on what track they are in. This test is required in order to graduate. If we fail, we need to do the senior year again. Although I'm not really objective be because I only know about City High, in my opinion, High school in America requires less time and is more relaxing. But something that I really like here that we don't have in France, at least in my high school, is all these opportunities for the students to experience something new with the electives. Getting to choose a class that can be helpful or fun is new for me and it's one of the reasons I like City High.